guys, welcome back to this week's video, and in today's vlog, we are going to be organizing my desk, floor, and bed back here. My room recently is going, well, like, soon, is going to be repainted from this baby pink into a baby blue. So, I got some blue supplies, and here's one of them. So this one is going to, it's like a book. I got it at the Dollar Tree. You can like slide all my books, sketchbooks, all that stuff. So on my desk, I do like to have a lot of things. So number one is my sketchbook. I cannot live without this thing. So let's just put it, oh, it doesn't fit. <laughs> but, um, hmm, that's weird, it doesn't fit, but I like having this, which is where it's crazy questions to ask your friends, so that fits in the bin, and one of these, I like, I have this sketchbook too, it's not the nicest, but I'll still put it in. Um, but we still like, so, like, I like reading the Descendants series, so I can put that right there. Then I have my yearbook from last year. I like looking at my pictures from last year, you know? And then I also, also enjoy, um, like, coloring and, oh, and like painting glass. So I got this that I can make perfection. This is gonna go on my desk right over here. Gosh, sorry guys, one second. I have no clue what just went on there, but what do you do with an empty bottom of a shoe bin? Take out everything first. Also, I'm going to do some hacks in here. Take out everything. Make sure it's totally empty with nothing in it. Paint the outside. I already painted it, and uh, I just put... We're going to paint over that in just a second. Okay, guys, I painted it over it, and it looks really cute. I personally like it. You can paint the inside if you want, but I just decided not to. This DIY is meant for all of your like cards from your birthday. For example, I have this one, which is from my friend Caroline, and it says selfies would be so much easier if I had thumbs. And I'm just gonna keep all of my like memories in here. So, like, what else? This one, you lost your tooth. Perfect. <laughs> and then this I got when I was five for my birthday, so I'm just gonna put it in here too, because I really never use it. This is another card from my other friends. I like this, it's kinda cute, road trip essentials. Um, the drawing. So I will be back when I am done like a picture with all of this. So see you guys. Okay guys, I am done. I just decided to fold that and put it in. But I actually have fun. So like I put card here like I put cards like this in here. I put Oh, this one's the funny one. I put this in here. It's like Claire's bomb. And I put this in here. So, per 
Smash it. <laughs> Adorable. And this. This is my first Sharpie ever, so I have to put it. All of my memories are safe in here, and I'm just going to put it right over here. Perfection. Now, I just got to... <sighs> Tired, guys. Tired. So, my mom ordered these bins for me on Amazon. They're little, like, clear bins. And I decided to use them. First one, I'm going to put, like, all of my whiteboard stuff in, because I do have a whiteboard hanging right there, and a calendar, so I'm going to need some stuff. Expo marker. Let me go get some stuff. You guys, come with. So, this is actually a good way to organize your stuff. Here's another one. Okay. Here's another one. I'm just going to slide that on in. Then we have a whole, like, expo marker with erasers. I'll be back when I'm done. In one second, guys. Let me just put all these little cute little pins. Okay, guys, I am done. This is what it looks like. So, I made this when I went to the uh, my grandma's house, and we just added a bunch of stickers on, and like FaceTime, party, goals, don't forget. All you have to do, take a piece of stone, take these stick-on cords, like things so that it doesn't like ruin your desk, and then... Take a little bit of glue, mix it in with a little bit of water, and take a paintbrush and put it on the back of a, like, cut out random pieces of a magazine. It doesn't have to be perfect, obviously. And then you just put it on the back of it and glue it on, and then Mod Podge it when you're all done, and it looks like this. It's so cool. I thought it was really cool, so I decided to make it, and it's used as, like, a phone holder. I use it for, like, so me and my little brothers and sisters have this little thing to keep in thing. Mine's Elsa. I have a little sister, you know, like, hello, hello. My sister's at school right now, so, um, obviously she's not going to answer, but anyway, yeah. And then in this next one, I decided to put in all of my kind of schooly supplies. So, like, index cards, washi tape, um, like, you know, those, you know, like, emergency things. Like, bobby pins, glow sticks. I have a bunch of these that I bought. Glow sticks and that. Okay, I'm done. One more bin, and then this bin is done, and we have two more, two more after that. So, this next one, I'm going to put all my jewelry in. So, like, my rings, my earrings, all that such. And I have, like, here's an earring, necklace cord, a ring. I'm also going to put some of my pins from soccer in there. So, here's some pins from soccer. And some more jewelry. Okay, this bin is officially done. Now I'm going to put it over right here. Next bin we got this one. First, we're going to put pens and pencils. I have a lot of pens and pencils in the first one, so I need to put my pens and pencils. And we're going to put stickers in there as well. These little cute stickers. And then, we're also going to put a pair of scissors. Perfect. That's the first bin. Next bin is going to be little American Girl doll things that maybe is going to look a little cute. 
this will go with my emergency bin. Then we have like some today stickers for the thing. This next bin is an odd bin. It's gonna have my paper clips in it. What no, not that one. That sorry, guys, I'm getting confused. But anyway, that was the first part of it. And hope you guys enjoyed it. Bye, see you guys in my next video.